In Joel chapter 2, verse 25 to 27. Joel chapter 2, verse 25 to 27. The Bible says, And I will restore to you the years that the locusts had eaten. Say amen. The cankerworm and the caterpillar and the pampaworm, my great army which I sent among you. And you shall eat in plenty and be satisfied. Say amen. And praise the name of the Lord your God that hath dealt wondrously with you. And my people shall never, never be ashamed in Jesus' name. 27. Hear this. And you shall know that I am the means of Israel and that I am the Lord your God and not us. And my people shall never be ashamed in Jesus' name. Say, O oh Lord, restore my wasted years in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord, restore my wasted years in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord, restore my wasted years. Restore my wasted years. In Jesus' name, it is done. Amen. We are looking on a topic. Unable to find something inside a bag. Unable to find something inside a bag. A bag is our favorite. Dreaming about a bag could stand as a symbol of a goal, money, person, or other possessions. It can be frustrating when we find it difficult to discover what has been missing in our care. In a dream, when you're unable to find something important inside a bag, this can represent loss, sorrow, lack, and trouble in your life. You might find yourself in a situation where you feel like you cannot find answers or solutions to your problems. In fact, you are stuck and confused in life. You are worried about your inability to achieve success. A bag contains vital things like key, phone, eyeglasses, perfume, water bottle, handkerchief, diary, and so on. Therefore, the dream of unable to find something inside a bag, therefore the dream may mean that there are other important things which you are lacking in your life. And this is making you incomplete as a person. When you are unable to find something inside a bag in a dream, it could be that you have been searching for information, opportunity, job, but all your effort proved abortive. Unfortunately, this is making you worry about how you are going to recover what was stolen or lost in your life. I pray, may you recover them in Jesus' name. You might feel like someone or something is moving away from you, and that makes you to lose vital opportunity or information. It's possible that you are worried about losing someone or something important to you, and which you're unable to get them back. You might feel like you are lost in your life, and that you need to get yourself back on track. You may need to look deeper within yourself to figure out what you are looking for, and where to find that thing. When you see yourself romantic through a bag, and unable to find the items in the dream, it means you are doing something in the wrong way, and that is why you are not progressing. You have done everything possible to live a good life, but nothing worked out for your effort. You are unable to perform some tasks in your life due to lack of finances. I pray, may God Almighty restore you in Jesus' name. You are feeling helpless in your current situation. If you cannot find anything in the bag in that dream, it means there is a curse upon your life and destiny. This curse is attacking good things in your life. It's attacking your success. It's attacking your chances of progressing. You need to pray very well to break that curse. There's no fulfillment in whatever you do. And this is causing you a lot of dissatisfaction. And if this is a job, you can try and change that job. Look for another job to do. An empty bag in the dream signifies physical and spiritual emptiness. You need to cry out to God to refill you again. If you find out that someone stole something inside your bag in a dream, it means to beware of envious and jealous people around you, especially greedy people. Your inability to find something inside the bag in a dream could mean that you are not properly prepared for something or you are not secure enough. But if you eventually found something inside the bag in a dream, this predicts happiness and restoration. The lesson about this dream is that you need to protect your valuables. You don't need to give any person access to the source of your income. Because if you give them the access, they will come after you and they will steal your goods. And that may attract you to be stagnated in life. Be careful. I pray for you. May God restore you. May you derive ultimate satisfaction in whatever you are doing in life. 
May your effort lead to success in Jesus' name. Instruction, read Proverbs chapter 6, verse 31. Proverbs chapter 6, verse 31. Take prayer for number one. Say, I paralyze all the activities of spiritual robbers in my life. In the name of Jesus, I paralyze all the activities of spiritual robbers in my life. In the name of Jesus, I paralyze all the activities of spiritual robbers in my life. In Jesus' name. Two, I recover all the blessings I have lost to the enemies. In the name of Jesus, I recover all the blessings I have lost to the enemies. In the name of Jesus, I recover all the blessings I have lost to the enemies. In Jesus' name. Three, Father, let there be all round restoration of my glory. In the name of Jesus, Father, let there be all round restoration of my glory. In the name of Jesus, Father, let there be all round restoration of my glory. In Jesus' name. Four, Father, let my captured glory be recovered and be restored to me by fire. In the name of Jesus, Father, let my captured glory be recovered and be restored back to me by fire. In the name of Jesus, Father, let my captured glory be recovered and be restored back to me by fire. In Jesus' name. Five, I receive divine restoration with compensation. In the name of Jesus, I receive divine restoration with compensation. In the name of Jesus, I receive divine restoration with compensation in Jesus' name. Prayer point number 16, last prayer point. Say, I bind and cast out every strong man in my life that has refused to release my breakthrough. In the name of Jesus, I bind and cast out every strong man in my life that has refused to release my breakthrough. I bind them. I bind them. I bind them. In the name of Jesus, I bind and cast out every strong man in my life that has refused to release my breakthrough. In Jesus' name, it is done. Amen. If this broadcast has blessed you, share it to your friends and family. This is Evangelist Joshua Reke. God bless you.